Hi, I'm Dr. David Hill, and today we're going to talk about how is the stomach flu spread. And the first question is, what do we mean when we say stomach flu? Well, people use that term to refer to a couple of different things. They may mean a viral infection of the intestines and stomach, a viral gastroenteritis. Those are almost exclusively spread through contamination on the hands. So you go to wipe or clean yourself, get a little bit of the contaminant, some of the virus on your hands. And if you don't wash your hands very thoroughly or use an alcohol hand sanitizer, then you may pass it on. I would recommend soap and water because some of these infections are caused by bacteria called Clostridium difficile. The Clostridium difficile is really resistant to the alcohol hand sanitizers. So if you're really worried about passing on one of these illnesses, nothing beats at least 10 seconds of soap and water to get the hands good and clean. Now, stomach flu, people may also refer to influenza, influenza A or B. And yes, it affects the stomach. It can cause vomiting, diarrhea, and abdominal pain, but it also affects the upper rearway. It may cause uh, cough, sneezing, uh, even pneumonia, stuffed up nose, sore throat. That influenza virus is spread through particle transmission, usually when people cough or sneeze. So that virus is susceptible to the alcohol hand sanitizer. And then if you're the one who has it, you want to try coughing into your elbow, disposing of used tissues in a timely fashion, and keeping a little hand sanitizer with you so that you don't leave it on surfaces or pass it to the next person you shake hands with. Talking about how to avoid transmitting the stomach flu to other people, I'm Dr. David Hill.